Hello, today I want to show you how to uninstall an NVIDIA graphics card driver from your computer. This is for um, PCs. I don't know how Macs are. I'm sure they're probably different with this procedure. But this is how you do it on a regular Windows based system. Basically what you do is go into your control panel and go to NVIDIA drivers, uninstall them, go through the, the process of uninstalling them. Once you're done with that, you want to get a program called Driver Cleaner Pro. There's many places to download it. Uh, I won't go into that right now, but you'll be able to find it. Just Google it. Other than that, uh, you want to once you install the Driver Cleaner Pro, uh, basically restart your computer after you uninstall the NVIDIA drivers. Uh, boot into safe mode and run Driver Cleaner Pro, and there'll be an option for uh, different types of things that you can do for uninstalling and all that. And basically, it'll give you uh, the drivers that you want to uninstall. Basically go to NVIDIA drivers, um, That's pr I'm pretty sure it's what it's called, it's been a little while, but NVIDIA drivers and uh, there's another one that will be for chipset, if you have an NVIDIA chipset, don't install, uninstall that one, that will cause a lot of problems. Just the one that says NVIDIA drivers and run through the test, or not test, the uninstall process on there to clean everything out. Basically it's what it does, it cleans the driver out to make sure there's no traces or anything left. Once that procedure is done, uh, what you want to do is restart your computer again, go into the control panel, go into the device manager, and make sure all the traces of the old driver is gone. Then what you can do is go to your to NVIDIA.com or whatever site you get your drivers from and install the new ones and go through the procedure of doing that. Uh, basically, once you're done with that, uh, everything should be good. Uh, play some games and do some different applications and make sure there's no artifacts or anything like that. If you overclock your video card, uh, go back to doing that. You might get higher overclocks, might be lower, it all depends. Um, some people can go the whole time without uh, getting new drivers, but people who play games a lot, a lot of gaming people, they will uh, upgrade uh, or update drivers often just to have better compatibility with games and other things like that. So, uh, Any questions, let me know. That's basic, uh, basically a easy way to say how to do it. Um, it's different ways to do it like I said before but this is the way I usually use. Some people just uninstall them in the device manager, reinstall them and everything's fine but usually if you play games or overclock um, it'll come into problems with the, the old drivers being there still a little part of it or something. So basically what you want to do is just make sure you use Driver Cleaner Pro and uninstall it, make sure everything's gone and then once everything's gone reinstall your new one and you'll be set to go. Thanks a lot for watching. Uh, check out my channel and see all the other computer videos that I have. And if you want, subscribe to me. If not, um, hope you learned something from the video. Thanks a lot.